Hello, and welcome back to more Final Fantasy IV, The After Years, with me, Idiot Kotok Ultimara. We're just about to start Porum's Tale. Uh, so we're now just over halfway. Again, you can read that out. Sorry. I, sorry. Pause that. Okay. That's fine. We're done. Well then, let us begin today's lesson. Yes, sir. Oh, a young Purim. Okay. Where is Palom? Oh, not again. I'll go get him. Oh. Uh, we've already read this. So there was in the slopes of my Nord Hills, facing down the fiery hordes when it cast an awesome blizzard. And... Bap. Leonora. Oh. How many times are you going to be late for training? The, el the Elder is really angry. Yep, there's Leonora. How many times must I tell you the same thing before it sinks into your th that thick skull of yours? You've got a deal of growing up to do. If you ever plan to be the sort of mage Tella was. Two more hours of spell transcription for you. Hello. No, oh, not again. You you've only got yourself to blame, you know. Oh forget this. I've had enough of this stupid dream. Palam! What a troublesome one. Please allow me to go after him, Elder. <laughs> Do I have to play as a young Palam and Porum? I have to drag him back before the Elder gets any angrier. Okay. Is Leonora still there? Nope. I thought Palom had finally decided to die to stage. Oh, I was wrong. There he is. Oh, that was quick. Give it up, Palom. The Elder wants to see you. Tough for him. I'm not gonna start my training all over again. No way. Petulant little child. Even if he is just a kid, a normal person like me could never understand what goes through the head of a genius like Palom. <laughs> Give it up, Palom. Now I want to see you. Oh my fucking god, really? <sighs> I don't know how to declare. Oh, whatever. I don't give a fuck. You're betting this, Palom. I thought you wanted to be a great sage like Teller. Hmm. Fine. You're right. You win. You look like you, you look like you're you have something on your mind, boy. Look, Elder. You might not be aware of this, but my skills have developed much more than you think. Palab. Is that so? There's nothing else here for you to learn. Is that what you are trying to say? Come on, Elder. You know just as well as I do how powerful we really are. Hold your tongue, Palom. You think so too, right, pa Porum? Without us, Cecil would have never made it anywhere near Mount Ordeals. We've grown so much since the journey we took. Haven't you realized that, Elder? Hmm. I suppose you have a point. I know I do. Because I'm going to become a sage, just like old Mantella. 
Della, you say? Then you have a long way to go, Palom. Growth is not just a something gained on your own. It is the product of all the people you meet along the way. From Cecil and Tella to everyone else around you. I already know that, Elder. I don't need you to tell me. It is a simple thing to say, but I forbid you from leaving my city. It is still too soon for you. Too soon? Well, when's it not going to be too soon? When you have truly understood the words I have spoken. Can I go out and travel the world once I do? Once you do, yes. All right, I'll be out of here in a flash. Cecil and the others will, the others will better be ready for me. How long? Are you sure what? Are you sure you meant to tell him that, Elder? Of course, the meetings and partings one experiences in life helps to strengthen the self. Yes, Elder. And I'm sure you would like. To hit the road yourself someday, Porum. I, I, I what? It is written on your face, plain as day. Oh. Yeah, probably back to where we are now. Oh, they're still kids though. How's that several years later? They're still fucking children. They're not teenagers or anything. Haha, -ha, finally. I'm off on my quest to become a sage. What made you want to visit Kaipo first? Because it's Tella's homeland, of course. What do you think? That's all? What do you mean, that's all? Don't you understand anything, huh? The title of sage isn't something to be obtained, it's something that's granted to you. Yeah, yeah, that's right. I knew that already. <clears throat> then, who do you think grants something like that to you? The Elder, right? No. The people of the world do. Nobody's going to call you a sage just because you've learned black and white magic. You have to throw away your own wishes. An ambitious palm. You learn to use your magic to benefit the whole world, not just yourself. <sighs> that goes without saying, Horum. Are you sure you know? Well, that's the way Teller was, wasn't it? You're right. Tella travelled around the world with the Elder himself, long ago. Just like we're doing right now. Wow, really? I knew it. Eventually, the Elder returned to Mycidia, and devoted his life to protecting the world without his magic. Tella, meanwhile, continued his travels for years afterwards, using his power for the good of all mankind. How long did you do that for? Oh, at least decades. Ugh, that long? And, on, and at, the top, at the end of his journey, he decided to settle down in Kaipo, where Anna was born. Huh, I didn't know that. Of course, it'll take longer for you than it did for him. <laughs> yeah, I'll give it a shot. Sure. I'm in this for a long haul. Because he's such an arrogant prick. Oh, 
Oof, finally. What are you complaining about? You slept practically the whole, entire way. We have a long way to go. A long way to Kaipo, don't we? It's in the middle of this huge Damsayan desert in front of us. So we should rest up while we can, you know? <sighs> Convenient excuse. Hi, uh... Kaipo. And I think I only met went here once in FF4, and that was at the very start of the game. I don't think I ever went to like many places more than once. Wow, Kaipo, we're here. What should we do first? Let's take it easy for now. But you've just spent days resting on that ship. Oh, quick complaining. What's the big deal? Hmm. This is the oasis of Kaipo, the only settlement in the all down side. Yep. If you're looking for Tella's grave, it might. It's right by the water. King Edward makes regular visits to Tella. And his grave sites, you know, I see him there all the time. Well, makes sense that he'd be there. I'm not seeing. I've seen um, him once, I think, this whole entire playthrough. My, you're certainly a young pair of travellers. Make sure you don't come down with a desert fever. Ah, okay. Not right, yeah, well, those, but okay. Ooh, a potion. The past of mist is still closed off, you know. It's giving me a serious headache. I guess practicing my synchronicity swimming near the graveyard isn't very appropriate. As long as we don't have any more war, I don't see why Kaipo can't become a great city. Well, I'm surprised it hasn't started thriving. Tell the great siege rests in this desert oasis together with his beloved daughter Anna. The old man's grave! Well, don't just stand there. Offer your respects to him. Tella, may you be happy together with Anna for all eternity. And may you guide us with your infinite wisdom, especially Paolo. He really needs it. Hey, old man. Guess it's been a while. Hasn't it? Well, oh, I'm finally here. I came to visit your homeland and everything. I hope you're watching over me, Tyler. Because someday I'm going to be a sage just like you. Tyler, is this why you wanted to come to Kaipo? Heh. <laughs> just thought I'd check up on the old man first, you know? Anna, daughter of the gate, great and gentle sage, rests in this desert oasis. Didn't realize Anna was as well. Anna, the woman Edward loved with all his heart. She must be a really nice lady. Maybe kind of like her mum. Anna, I witnessed in person the grace and profound love you possessed within. May you rest in peace alongside Tella for all time. 
Sometimes I wonder if I, too, have a choice. A chance to become a woman like you. A woman who knew how to love more deeply than anyone else. What? Nothing. Right, on to training the then. To the underground waterway. Where is that? Where is the what? Where the fuck it what? Game. What? Is that this place up here? I'm assuming it's this. Yes, okay. I know we've just started, but I'm gonna save it anyway. An attack. There we go. I expect that to be pretty much just what I'm going to do for the whole time. I don't even know what level these guys are. Ten. Okay. Lightning arrows. Mm, yeah. Okay, that makes sense. And also using uh, thunder makes a lot of sense. And the underground water we. So much tense, it makes dollars. <laughs> These weren't here. This must be the place the bridge where Talon first met. What's wrong? Nah, it just struck me. I'm really walking down this path, aren't I? I'm gonna be a sage if I keep this up. Stop thinking about superfluous blah, 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 blah. superfluous things in the middle of training. Superfluous, superfluous. That was it. That was what she was saying. Superfluous. They already have more fucking mana than Tell ever did. Hmm. Tell didn't have much mana to be fair. 99 I think was the most he had, but he was also an old, old man. Old 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 man. Yay, they both leveled up. Oh, you learned Pig. Good for you, pal. You didn't even learn Pig in your... Or, you did learn Pig, but it was later on. You weren't like level 5. 10, sorry. In the war. Uh, nothing. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Wizard's hat. And I'm going to be putting that on Porum. Because she is the one I'm going to be keeping.
What the fuck? Then now, good. Was not expecting that. Okay, that's fine. Now we'll leave and go to the next section. Yay. I know I'm finding this tedious, but I still will check everything because I am a loot whore. I want to find everything. I don't have to, but I want to. because I'm not 100%ing. Ugh. Oh, hello toads. Bye toads. I'm also sort of fed up with play, playing for a fantasy in general. I've played so much in the past short while. It's why I normally take a break between my Final Fantasy playthroughs. Because I, I know that I'll get fed up. And so it's not really the fault of this game completely. It's not a great game so far. But it doesn't help that I'm just... Worn out. Oh well, next is play fucking PU4, holy shit. <sighs> oh, fuck. I went the right way, damn it. I went the correct way. I didn't want to go the correct way. Damn it. Gosh damn it. There we go. Guy gear. Yes! Yes! Again, that's all good on power. My power. Because uh, Palam is the character I'm going to be keeping after this little side tangent thing. No idea how the longest side tangent would be. Ugh. 
Like, for example, I'm less excited about playing um, this than, say, I was about playing FF7 Remake. Uh, FF7 Remake, I bought a whole fucking console to play that bloody game. And I played it for like 12 hours a day until I finished it. This I'm playing for 3 hours a day. If that. If I've either been in the mood to play for 3 hours a day and then I, I don't really want to be playing it. I do want to play it because it's another Final Fantasy game. And I do want to finish every single one of them. I want to see what, how good or bad it's been getting over the years. Um, that was my main objective with playing every Final Fantasy backwards. Should have played it the other way to be fair. Should have played it from the first to the last. Uh, which would have given me a better indication of how good or bad the games have gotten. But I think going from where it is now to how it was is actually a really nice way of what the fuck what the fuck I really dislike the fact that I can't see shit Like, I am literally in the goddamn dark. I really dislike this. I can't see anything. Oh, he didn't die. Holy shit. Are you still not dead? Fuck me. Wow, you're tough. You still give me no fucking experience, though. Wow, that was terrible. And it's 100% not gonna be worth it. 100% not gonna be worth it. That was so shit. That was... Uh... That was such a... Mm. Oh, that was bad. Jesus fucking Christ, that was bad. I travelled all that way for a fucking... For an item that casts haste. Oh shit. Horror of my die here. Mm, maybe not actually. Oh, part of my oh part of did die. Shit. Damn. Uh Oops. Erps. Yeah, that was dumb. Yeah, make sure I'm fully healed, please. Is that an electrofish as well? Because that might have been an electrofish. Also, there's nothing there. Uh, can I just do that? Oh, you're just gonna attack? I don't like that. I, I, yeah, I can't have you just attacking. 
I need you to run away. Um, yeah, I'll see you all in the next episode. Thank you all for watching. Have fun, people, and goodbye.